Hello, fourth graders. I'm sure many of you remember bucket drumming. And I know many of you don't have a bucket at home or drumsticks necessarily. So I want you to see if you can find maybe two pencils or two pens, and then find a flat surface that you can use. If you can't find two pencils or two pens, that's fine. You can also just use your hands. But the main thing you need is a flat surface. Okay, so let's look at level one, the white belt. So the first thing you should notice is that at the beginning it says four, and then there's a quarter note right underneath it. So that means that there's going to be four quarter notes in each measure. And the big lines, I call them bar lines, separate the measures. If you count all the quarter notes in this exercise, you'll notice that there's 16 altogether. And if you count all the measures, there's four measures, so four quarter notes in each measure. Okay, so first I want to play this pattern in the air, alternating hands, going back and forth between right and left. Okay, so get ready. Try it with me. Remember, if you don't have pencils or pens, you can just use your hands. Okay? One, two, ready, go. Right, left, right, left. Right, left, right, left. Right, left, right, left. Right, left, right, left. Okay, now let's try it a different way. Let's count each beat. And remember to alternate hands. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And let's try it one other way. Let's use our rhythm syllables to read the notes. So remember that for a quarter note, the sound we make is do. Okay? One, two, ready, go. Do, 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 do. Okay, now for the really fun part. I want you to play this pattern for the white belt, level one, along with me playing the guitar. So I'm going to help out. I'm going to count each beat out loud. And I want you at home to play along. Just tap the beat. One, two, three, four. Remember, just one sound per beat, because that's what quarter notes should sound like. All right, get ready. A one, two, one, two, ready, go. One, two, three. Make sure you stop right there. Don't keep going. Okay, friends, let's try level two, the yellow belt. So this one is a lot like the other one. It also has four beats in every measure. However, what's different about this one is it starts out with some eighth notes. If you remember correctly, eighth notes are exactly twice as fast as quarter notes. And before we try the different hands on this one, I want you to read it with me using your rhythm syllables. So as a review, quarter notes are do. Eighth notes are do day. So if I were to read this pattern right here with my rhythm syllables, it would sound like this. One, two, ready, and... Do day, do day, do, do, do day, do day, do, do, do day, do day, do, 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 do. Now try it with me. One, two, ready, go. Do day, do day, do, do, do day, do day, do, do, do day, do day, do, 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 do. Okay, here's an extra credit 
Bonus question. Which measure is different from all the others? Remember, each measure has four beats in it. Look at the first measure, the second measure, the third measure, and the fourth measure. Which one is different? Okay, let's try that same rhythm, but alternating hands. So that's going to be a little bit trickier, but say it with me, using your rhythm syllables. One, two, ready, go. Do, day, do, day, do, do. Do, day, do, day, do, do. Do, day, do, day, do, do. Do, 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 do. So all you have to do is just alternate hands. Let's try it on the surface. So find your flat surface, get ready, and try it with me. One, two, ready, go. Do day, do day, do, do. Do day, do day, do, do. Do day, do day, do, do. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's try that same rhythm but using numbers to count with instead of rhythm syllables. So when I play this, it's going to sound like this. One and two and three, four. One and two and three, four. One and two and three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, try that with me. One, two, ready, go. One and two and three, four. One and two and three, four. One and two and three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, get ready to play along with the yellow belt pattern. One, two, ready, go. All right, so let's take a look at level three, the blue belt. This one is really not much different than the last one we did. Look carefully. It starts with a quarter note, followed by two eighth notes that are connected by a beam, then another quarter note, and then another quarter note. Okay, so it's really pretty similar to the last one. All right, so let's read this rhythm three different ways. First way, will be with our rhythm syllables. Remember, quarter notes go along with the sound do. Eighth notes go along with the sound do day. Ready? One, two, one, two, ready, go. Do, do day, do, do. Do, do day, do, do. Do, do day, do, do. Do, do, do. Let's try with counting. So we're counting the beats. Each measure gets four beats. But since eighth notes are twice as fast as quarter notes, we want to add an and after the beat if we see eighth notes. So let's count this using our beat numbers. Ready? A one, two, one, two, ready, and one, two, and three, four. One, two and three, four. One, two and three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's try air drumming that rhythm with right hand and left hand. One, two, one, two, ready, go. Right, left, right, left, right. Right, left, right, left, right. Right, left, right, left, right. Right, left, right, left. You might notice that we have to double up on the right hand at the very end of the first measure, it says right hand, and at the very beginning of the second measure, it also says right hand. So that's a new skill that you have to kind of get used to. Okay? One, two, ready, go. Okay, friends, so now that you've learned those rhythms, I want you to find a song that you really like. 
and I want you to take those rhythms and play those rhythms at the same time. Now the song that you choose might have a tempo that's slightly faster or slower than the one that we were just practicing. All right, friends, let me demonstrate for you. So the song that I'll be playing along with is called Sir Duke by Stevie Wonder. And Stevie Wonder was a great musician who wrote this song about one of his heroes, the jazz musician Duke Ellington. This is a picture of Duke Ellington right up here. All right, so when I press play, first I have to find the tempo. I have to figure out where one, two, three, and four are. And then I'll play all three of those rhythms that we just learned. Here we go. So first, you have to find the tempo. Right. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right, get ready. Here's the white belt. One, two, three, four. 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 Get ready for the yellow belt. One, two, and one, and two, and three. Two and three, one and two and three, one two three. 